Hello and welcome to another CamCloud demo. Today we're going to show you some of the new features of our mobile app, which you can download if you have an iOS or Android device. This is the cameras page. It shows you a summary of your camera's recent activity with a count of the number of motion events displayed right next to each camera. If you tap any of the cameras on this page, it'll take you straight to the timeline page. We've built the timeline from the ground up for mobile. Now you can use the touch screen to move the timeline to any point in time, find your recorded media, and play it back. All your video clips and images play using a continuous playback, just like on the web. The blue bars shown here are motion events. The timeline has two playback options. So the first is right below the timeline bar. The second is on the screen itself. Tap any event to highlight it, then tap the play button to start. You can pause and continue playing by tapping on the screen. You can also enlarge the screen by tapping here. In the right hand corner right above the live view button is the calendar. You can select the date of the motion events you want to be displayed on the timeline. Right now it says Friday, November 13th. So let's change that to November 10th. And there, the motion events are loaded. Now let's back out and add a camera. So you can add a camera by tapping on the plus sign on the right hand corner. So I'll add a Foscam C1 just to make things easier. All right, all right and next. The camera is there, but there aren't any motion events here. What I can do is also click on the live view button here right under the calendar. Right now the video feed that I'm getting is live and you can turn off live view by just tapping the live view button again. One last thing I want to add for the timeline page is we've added the settings button on the top right corner. Here you can adjust the camera settings like turning on or off notifications and you can also just delete the camera. Alright now let's go back. Lastly tapping the sidebar here gives you access to changing your account settings, adding and editing schedules and turning on or off the motion detection of all cameras. Finally, whenever you make a change to the desktop version of your account, simply tap the refresh button found here to update any changes you've made on the site. Keep in mind that when you sign in, the app automatically refreshes itself to the latest settings. So that's it for the demo. If you have any issues, contact support at camcloud.com. And on that note, until next time.